Pro Tools SE has some incredible mixing effects built right into the program. Let me show you how easy it is to add this DSP to the tracks that you've already recorded. So I'm back in my session here. I've just finished recording a clavinet part. Now the clavinet is an instrument track and you can see directly below it in effects A slot, there's a reverb. Just click to open the effects window and edit away. A different preset. And there is a nice spring reverb. To remove the effect entirely, just choose no effect. Now you can add effects from the open effects window or do it directly from the track. The dynamic delay is a great effect. Tempo can be synced or free time. Feedback. And there's the wet dry mix. The factory presets can be found just up here. Just recall any of them and you can use them as a starting point and edit them and shape them to fit your session or your song. Now if you like something that you've got going, take a moment to save it as a custom preset. Give it a name, save, done. There are plenty of effects to choose from, including modulation effects like a good phaser, incredible on a clavinet. On slot B, let's add the delay. Then add a bit of reverb on slot C. Large hall, bring that down, nice. Now let's hear it in the mix. Now once you've added effects to the track, you can save that configuration. In this case, choosing save setting as will save the clavinet instrument, the phaser, the delay, and the reverb all in one go, allowing you to recall it at a later date. Custom settings are stored under instrument settings. Remove. Now effects and instruments are empty and you'll no longer hear the clavinet. Come over and flip the list, recall your custom preset, and everything will be restored just the way you left it. Fantastic.